Welcome back to Resident Evil Village. I said I would come back and play any DLC that gets released, and guess what? DLC is released, so here I am. Shadows of Rose is what's come out. I know we get to play as Rose. I know it's supposed to be quite good, and that's really all I know about it. I haven't seen any gameplay whatsoever. Going into this completely fresh, let's go. Special. Change Rose's appearance. Oh, I think I might have gotten like a pre-order outfit, maybe? <laughs> the Street Wolf outfit? Let's see, how does that compare? To <laughs> okay. Oh my god, that's such an like edgy teen thing. I love it. Street Wolf outfit. We can bite some street justice into people. It's either that or dad's jacket. I'm going to be an edgy teen. Let's take the street wolf outfit. <laughs> oh. I forgot how arcane and bizarre the um, mouse and keyboard controls are for this game. Right click to go back and then F for OK. Like, what is that? What difficulty did I play the original game on? I don't know, but I do remember I got pretty good at it, given that I did a sort of half-assed speedrun at one point. Let's go with hardcore. I can always change it, I think. Hey, Kay. Okay. Sorry I'm late. It's okay, I'm just enjoying the day. You said you had something important to tell me? I hope it's not about Chris wanting me to join his operation, because I already told him that's not happening. I see what he puts you and the rest of his hound wolf squad through. <laughs> no, thank you. It's not about that. It is about you. Me? I... If I worry about you. How is, um... How are things at school? <laughs> Seriously? That's what you wanted to talk to me about? That group of mean girls still hassling you? <laughs> I mean, are they still treating me like a freak? Hey! Uh-uh. Look at me. You are not a freak. I am. You know I am. That's why I keep my distance from everybody at school. If they knew what I really was. So... You don't have any friends that you can talk to? <laughs> talk to? About what? How I'm hardly even human, how I'm some kind of horrendous monster. <laughs> but, hey, it's okay. I hardly ever murder my friends. What if there were a way to get rid of your powers? I'd get rid of them in a heartbeat. All right, well, I think there's something I need to show you. You already know about Miranda and the mutamycete, how she researched it obsessively and performed experiments on human subjects. Like me. Exactly. Uh, what you don't know is that we recently found some of her research. Apparently, she discovered a purifying crystal that can remove the mutamycete from its host. Purifying crystal? If we can get our hands on one of these, we might be able to weaken or remove your powers entirely. Are you kidding me? No. No, but her notes are incomplete. However, I think I have an idea where we can find the rest of her research. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's find it. Where is it? Uh, in there. What? That's a fragment of the Megamycete. It absorbs and stores memories from people who pass away in close proximity, including Miranda and everything she knows. If you enter its consciousness, you might be able to solve the mystery of the purifying crystal. Wait, what do you mean enter its consciousness? Oh, so, okay, so you, your deep connection will allow you to explore the information within. That sounds crazy. You sound crazy. Yes, 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 Rose, but not dangerous, right? Think of it just like walking through somebody else's memories. 
You really think this can work? I think it's worth trying. What do you have to lose? Uh, how do I even do this? <laughs> Shit, I, I don't know. Try reaching out to it. See what happens. Okay. Fine. What the hell? Oh my god, Rose is so weird. Yeah. It's like she sees things that aren't there. Creepy. Stay away from us, you freak. Imagine wanting to be friends Ugh, she's with her. Definitely. Ew. Something just moved on her hand. What's wrong with her? Shut up. Yeah. Yeah. It's like she sees things that aren't there. Freak. Creepy. Ew. Something just moved Go on her hand. Oh wait. Freak. Oh wait. Freak. Just oh, disgusting. Oh, Please oh, just shut up. I'm still here? Kay. Kay? Where are you? Kay! This isn't right. And we're in control. I'm very curious if they're going to have combat or if this is going to be maybe more puzzly or more survival and uh, evade and things like that. You know, it just struck me that this is in third person in the original uh, base game wasn't. <laughs> Although they did actually, uh, when they released this DLC, they also kind of released a bit of a patch for the game that added a third person mode so you can actually play through the base game in third person with ethan miranda's research claims that the mega my seat preserves the memories of people who passed away within its area of influence absorbing them into its own vast consciousness we also know based on our previous encounters with the mold that people who are contaminated with the, the mutamycete are connected in a kind of mold network. If we extrapolate from this, we can surmise that subjects with a strong affinity to the mutamycete should be able to use the network to connect to the memories of the dead within the megamycete. It should be possible to verify this theory using the lab's megamycete sample we collected 16 years ago. We just need a suitable subject with a proven connection to the mold. Unfortunately, this presents a problem. Our organization's policies prevent us from directly contacting civilians who are infected with mutamycete. Certainly, the ethical reasoning is understandable, but it has rendered the confirmation of this theory impossible. It pains me to think of how much mankind could stand to benefit from this preservation and indexing of human consciousness. The possibilities of preserving or even reclaiming great minds. Perhaps there's some way of cutting through the red tape. Enter a teenage girl. Wait, what? Something bloody came out of there. I'll be next if I'm not quick. I need to get that crystal.
Oh, Jesus. Torturous masks. the same general color as the mega my seed so i guess it's like mold basically <laughs> mold goo dress shoe Don't get any of that mold goo on your edgy jacket. Rose is officially a wolf girl. Don't like that. Let me out. That voice didn't sound very scary. Dangerous here. What is? Why? Hang tight. I'm gonna see if I can find a key. Crematorium seems a little overstuffed. That's my name. To create art, simply add to the rabbit's carcasses. Decay is not an issue. Note, spruce them up with a bit of makeup. It makes them seem more alive. What? Yeah, let's go use that key as fast as we can. I think we're gonna... I think we're gonna get chased there, though. Thanks. 
Thank you. That was a... You look just like me. Who are you? I'm Rose. What's going on here? Must keep moving. But... Too dangerous here. Oh, a little home. Need help? Help me lift. Hey, wait, where are you going? There's other copies of me. There are more, and they all look just like me. Do you know what's happening here? Hey, are you listening to me? And the switch handle's missing. It's gone. Need to find that handle quickly. Go deeper. That just goes back to where I just was. Hmm. So it's a shortcut that I might need to use at some point. that noise I'm not entirely convinced that they're entirely dead I bet they're gonna grab me you're gonna grab me aren't you so many bodies Ooh. one of these is gonna grab me Oh, this is blocked off now. We have to go this way. What? Is that going to be our weapons? We have special powers. Oh, for now, I think I should just get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I 
to opening nice and slow. Oh There's a couple more coming. Are you okay? What were those things? What is happening here? How? What is this? Where am I? Not until I get this. Out of my body. There's a crystal here that will remove the mold. I, I need to find it. And I'm not leaving until I do. Who are you? M my guardian angel? Do you have a name? If you're an angel, then... Gabriel? Michael? Okay. Michael? What now? I was wondering if it could be Ethan, because Ethan would be in the Megamycete as well. I mean, everybody is who's contacted it, but involved with it in any way. But they seem a bit sassy, and Ethan's really not sassy at all. So I kind of doubt it is. Like, is the Megamycete just some torture factory where endless clones are spun up and then murdered horrendously by mold creatures that suck away their flesh? That sounded like the voice of the traitor guy. Oh, I wish I had a knife so I could break this. I bet there's loot in it. Anything in there? <laughs> Not that you could ever see it. I had nothing. Nothing at all. Except first aid med.
Maybe everything's twisted in here. Maybe the traitor is now an enemy. Another. <laughs> Lively now, aren't you? You should have put that effort into running. It would have made the chase that much more thrilling. Uh, let me go! Let me go! It would seem this little rabbit lacks the necessary fortitude. Uh. A pity. You had shown a little grit and actually escaped. That purifying crystal would now be yours. The crystal? <gasps> Who's this? <laughs> oh, now we have a new little rabbit to pursue. Let's see how fast this one is. Find her! Hunt her down! Well, that explains the rabbits thing. Get a gun. What, like this? <sighs> Point and shoot. <laughs> All right, so there's going to be combat. Look at it shrivel up. That's really cool. It leaves an outline of mold. Silver wolf. That's right, that's what a wolf sounds like. Oh yeah, don't touch it, don't touch it. What are those things? My god. Nothing. Okay. I wonder where I might find the next rabbit. Well, this is open now. Yeah, I can't go that way. They're gone. Is it going to hurt me to approach this? No. God, it's so pretty, though. Even though it's horrifying and dangerous, it's very, very pretty. I wish I had a knife. I don't know if it's worth shooting these. I'm going to try it. Nothing. Once more, nothing. Oh, feels bad. I definitely don't have enough ammo to even kill one of those things now.
Hmm. Three staring red eyes and a nice looking shotgun. Grant me that which sees the what did that say? Sees the Sees the truth through its three eyes. I'm guessing this is locked, the courtyard. Yeah. Oh. He's some kind of other item. Probably bolt cutters. Cut the chain, yeah. Can't seem, can't seem to open any drawers. Ugh. Did that do it? No, it didn't do it. I'm out of ammo. Oh, bull cutters. Oh, it's locked. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Fuck. Fuck. Go. <laughs> oh, no. I hope this is an instant death. Is it? Jesus, that's horrifying. Not instant death, but it's pretty bad. That just like absorbing of the flesh. Ugh. The effect is kind of like burning, kind of like melting. If you really want to help, you could back me up against those things. I can't. So I'm on my own? Great. I want to finish that thing. a gross lumpy thing growing here. Lumpy thing? How am I supposed to break it? My powers? I literally came here to get rid of them. Okay, fine. But how? What am I supposed to do? What's that? It's a cage, except I don't think I can shoot that. I think I need my amplifier so I can shoot that with my powers. Mm, kind of want to look around for ammo. But realistically, I probably can't go through any other door. So let's just go this way first. Another one of me. Let's 
so many of me. I can use these things and combine them together. Herb and chem fluid, gunpowder and chem fluid. Might be more items I can combine. I need to do whatever I can to survive. Yeah, crafting system seems to work as before. One's locked. Uh, yeah, I don't have the ammo for those. Oh, no, that didn't sound good. Uh, Go, 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 go. I think I need that amplifier right about now. I remember all these rooms. Is that the amplifier, maybe? No, probably not, because I think I need the amplifier to bust that thing to get to it. Use that as a bridge? It's like it senses my presence when I'm near it. It's boiling for me. like a statue or anything. That just straight up looks like a turtle. Or tortoise. I don't remember the difference. W variant flask one. So, what am I supposed to do with this thing? Focus? All right. I feel different somehow. See if this works. Ooh, look at all these specimens. Oh, those are horrifying. I wish I didn't look at all these specimens. I found a means of dramatically destabilizing parts of the mutamycid network by introducing a disruptive force to block the auto-inducers they use for communication. For example, the hard-packed cores of mold known as sclerotia begin to break down on a cellular level and disintegrate when thus disrupted. Sclerotia form when the mutamycid develops in new locations, serving as a sort of anchor point or foothold. They're often associated with a patch of liquid void through which the mold has spread. 
When the autoinducers of the sclerotia are disrupted, it begins to break down. Any liquid void connected to the sclerotia will also disintegrate. It would appear that destabilizing the sclerotia sends a signal indicating that location is no longer viable for mutamycete habitation, triggering a full-scale retreat. Okay, so I think the sclerotia are those cores, those like flower, bud, whatever things. And it sounds like any mold creatures that came from the pool associated with any particular sclerotia will maybe die or retreat if you take out the source. So it might be ideal to use my weapon as little as possible and try to just go for the core if I can. Do I... Like... What do you... What do you mean focus here? Like... Is there a... A button? Okay, well Q turns us around. 160. Oh! Yeah, the space button! Yeah! I wonder if it would do anything to the creatures themselves. Maybe slow them down or something? Oh, that's satisfying. Uh, Jesus, could you not have grabbed the ladder? Did you? <laughs> Holy shit, Rose. I can't get around it. I need to get rid of it. Okay, I'm going to I'm going to try to dodge it. Oh, let me see if I can like do anything to it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh man. We really can't move that fast. Yeah, so does that does that kill it? The creature at all? No, it doesn't seem like it. I don't think this one's going to do anything either. No. Yeah, so when it said full-scale retreat, it was just talking about the sclerotia and the goo, not the creatures, I don't think. High capacity mag, nice. Is that installed automatically or? Yeah, it wasn't installed automatically. Oh Jesus, right. The inventory system is arcane. It's shift to move and then, no, <laughs> click rotates. <laughs> what puts it down again? Shift again, shift again, okay. And then not escape to exit the menu, but right click. <laughs> You know, just like a normal game.
don't know if stealth was an option. It just kind of felt like, what's the point when I have a flashlight on, you know? No! Fuck! Ugh. Oh no! No no no! That's- that's bad! I'm dead. Push me into the goo. Ugh. That's horrifying! God! You are lost. Not you're dead, but you're lost. I do wonder if I die in here, do I die in real life? This feels pretty real. Try number two. Oh, there's a third one. I don't have the ammo for that. Okay, I need to take out that Sclerosha. And then I need to get back to where I was. Oh. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go in there, but I think shooting them is the wrong move because, I don't know, it seems like they've respawned or there's so many that I can't possibly take them out. I mean, I have some crafting stuff, but enough to make... 30, uh, 24 shells, right? 16? Yeah, 24. 24 shots, that'd be... That might be enough. That actually could be enough to kill three. Definitely enough to kill two. I'm not even sure where to go. What am I doing in here? Oh, that door! That door! Oh my god. make a first aid. All right, we did it. Where's the where's the sclerosha for that? Are they going to come through that door? No, I think I'm okay. All right. All right. I should probably make some ammo. Ooh, something big is outside.
Oh, I have to go outside right now, don't I? Yeah. Oh boy. on down. I can run the better. What's wrong? Everything. Everything. Yeah, exactly. None of this was supposed to happen. No. The reason I came here hasn't changed. I need that crystal. Thank you. map yes there is I'm not sure if this map would show the sclerosha I suppose it would show up as currently searching when the room is red meaning there's something in there I haven't done why does the dining room show up is that though It's not just that there's something undone, because you can see there's like an exclamation mark here, which means there's something undone in there, but I don't think I can do it yet, which is why it's search completed. It's blue instead of red. So why does the dining room have red? Does the mask go there? I thought it needed a key or something. Could there be a gem? I don't think... Like, I don't think money exists in this DLC. I'm like 99% sure the mask is not going to do anything. Yeah, of course not. Why would it? we need, huh? The disciples await their masks. Bronze, silver, gold. With their garb arrayed, the light shall be released. Yeah, it's a single slot. I think that's what this mask is for. And two more masks.
It's a hand-drawn map. Just the keys in the dressing room. Which is like somewhere here. Okay, that door opens. Kind of wasn't expecting it to. Dang, I can't use my focus powers to <laughs> break urns. So I can go in there. Wait, have I not been there? I think I... Yeah, I have. So that's just a shortcut. choose to believe there will be something in one of them at some point. Ugh. Oh my god, okay, we better go. Go, 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 go. This way. <laughs> Just like last time. Uh. Yes, really, it's just like last time. I think it is an echo of that. Running away from those... those daughters. Those things chased me in here, but where is it? But the, the monocular key was supposed to be here somewhere. It's not in this room, though. It, it must be close by. Don't go. Too weak. Oh, thank you. Oh, I am so glad we get to go here again. Remember this was the room of horrible performance where when I went up there into that room, I got like 15 FPS for some reason, only in that room, no other place in the entire game. I wonder if they've changed it. Performance is fine, nice and smooth. It's horrible again. <laughs> What's wrong with this room? <laughs> Cursed. Oh my god, it's so bad. I hope I don't have to fight in here. Last time I had to do a boss fight in here at like... This is actually like worse than 15 FPS. This might be like 10. Oh, there's an old cannon in here. <gasps> oh. Another flask. Looks like there are more of these. Stronger now. How so? Like, in what way am I stronger? Focus on enemy. Oh, now we can hurt the enemies? Yeah, we can... I don't know if it hurts them, but it certainly slows them down. For quite a while, too. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I just got an achievement called It's Starting to Grow on Me. I want to see if we can kill it. If the third one doesn't do it, I'm going to shoot them and see how many shots it takes. Okay, yeah, it doesn't seem to do any damage to them, it just slows them down. But, I mean, that already is very good. Do my powers recharge? It took... Uh, each time I used that on an enemy, it took one of those white, like... I don't know, megamycete buds away from the bottom right of the screen. And now they're all empty, all three of them. Are they going to come back with time, or... What charges them? Watch this. Performance is horrible, horrible, and perfect. Nice and smooth. I really want to know what's wrong with that room. Sprig of White Sage. That's new. What is that for? Oh! It's probably a mana potion, basically. Or, like, part of a mana potion. Like, green herb, but... For my ability. An herb that restores some mutamycete power. Yeah, okay, well. Kind of wish I didn't use all three back there, but I didn't know how it worked. Should I use it? It says some, which makes me think it might not give me all three. Gives me two, okay. The big boys out there, I'm gonna have to slow them down for sure. Okay, well, uh, this is a bit of a dead end, I think, so <clears throat> let's chill down for a second and read this. As previously discussed, disrupting the auto-inducers within a mutamycete network can have destabilizing effects on the mold. These effects can also be observed in beings formed of mold. Rather than the cellular, cellular disintegration observed in sclerotia, however, this instead presents as a dramatic slowing of movement, practically freezing the being in place. If other bodies are in close proximity to the target, this disruption effect can spread, but only within a very limited sphere of influence. Oh, that's really important. So if I do one, when they're grouped together, it'll do all the others that are right next to them. Oh, that's really important. So, I, yeah, I can use that on this group. Oh, well, now they're not grouped together. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Ah! I hope leaving the room will reset their positions. Maybe. I think it does. Yes! Oh, damn it! Oh, this is bad. I couldn't use my ability because I was in the goo. Come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. Wait, I never actually even got a key up there, did I? 
Was it in the dressing room? I don't have the ammo or the mutamycete power to go back and freeze them all. Shit. It says I'm missing something in the gallery. Oh, I didn't even really go in the gallery. Let's go back up there. The enemies don't bother me too much. Yeah, I think I'm okay. Yeah, I just like opened this door, but I didn't actually go inside. This looks like a puzzle. A painting of a butterfly. The picture is fixed in place and can't be removed. Put the map there. <laughs> yeah, so we need a painting. Oh, or maybe we need to rearrange the paintings. So this one's fixed. It doesn't move. Painting of wolves, fixed in place and can't be removed. Sheep. And a frog. Hmm. Do I need... I probably need another painting to be able to fill them all out. Probably. The predators stand united, each staring down their prey. Okay, well... Wolves would be one predator. And they're staring down their prey, so across would be the sheep. Wolves eat sheep. What eats a butterfly? Do frogs eat butterflies? I don't know, I guess probably. A spider's definitely a predator, but I need something for it to eat and I don't have it. Let me see if they've maybe gone away. <laughs> no. Okay. I think I need to go in there, though. Hmm. I can make a lot of ammo, to be honest. Do I actually need to go there? What about down on the bottom floor? There's still the dining room, but I don't have anything to put in there. Hmm. There is some, there is some doors. Hold on. Yeah, there's some doors down here that I haven't tried. I don't want to waste all that ammo up there just in case I don't even need to. Yeah, I haven't used this door. Oh my. This room here used to be where you do the upgrades. Used to be where the trader was. I don't think it's going to be that anymore. Nope. Wait, what does that need? I think maybe just a key. I do not recall a single thing. Not who I am, nor who, how I came to be. I know nothing. My memories are as broken as the face I hide behind this mask. All that remains is this feeling, this hunger, to see others in pain, the despair in their eyes, the sounds of their screams. Who will be my next quarry? I have my minion to do my bidding. He has many faces, but no brains within those skulls. He is my best hound, and he will chase those rabbits down. Was that the big moldy boy?
<laughs> salon. Yeah, that was that room, the salon. Um, oh wait, this way. Yeah, it shows you as being able to go there, but it is moldy. have to go upstairs. Let's get fighting. Let me just double check exactly where that map shows. Yeah, the dressing room, huh? Yep, that's that room. more ammo can I craft? Two more. Let's craft it all. I think there's at most, like, one more. I, I think this is gonna be the last one. If it isn't, I'm kinda screwed, because I don't have enough ammo to kill another one. <laughs> oh man, please. Yes, that was all of them. Oh. Okay. Where did I miss the key? Oh, it's just right there. Right. Fuck. I just panicked. Trying, but it's hard when I'm being hunted by a demented giant and his creepy minions. Yeah, I guess I can't fight them all. He went in, but nothing happened. Oh. Yeah, it needs something else. You see it go in. It fits at all, except there's like little winglets that are coming off of it that it doesn't have. Yeah. Oh, that wasn't even necessary, was it? It's just a nice upgrade. This has increased firepower? So does it do more damage? Normally, I think, yeah, in the base game, when you upgraded your weapon, you could see exactly how much damage it did, if I remember right. But here, I don't think there's any way to actually look at stats. Oh, no, it says here. Hmm. Yeah, it says power, 126 plus 26. So it was 100 before, now it's 26. 
26% more damage. That's a nice increase. There's a door I didn't try back here. Ah, yeah. I'm fine, but what about you? Is that why your words are fading? Try not to overdo it then. Yeah, that elevator used to take you to the roof. I didn't catch this before, in the courtyard. It's one of the masks. There's a note. Monocular door deep in the basement. Deep in the basement? But I went down to the basement on the map and... I don't see anything there that's red or, or anything. Hmm. Well, this has just got a single eye. Does this open with it? Aha! Uh -huh. Ugh! Oh, you're quite the tricksy little rabbit to have made it this far. The next mask, however, won't be nearly as easy to get your grubby paws on. What's that Welcome to the Gallery of Despair, a wondrous display of those few who succeeded in obtaining at least one mask. Set your sights upon those chosen few whose final moments of despair are preserved forever in this gallery. Witness in this collection the light of life from a different perspective. She thanks. That sick bastard. Ah, yes. I'm going to use that immediately. Oh, they're not going to come in here. Although I have just drowned, the arrow's bite doth sting. They hanged me long ago, yet I feel everything. But still the worst, not last nor first the sharpened blade did ring. Okay, so we have a kind of like somewhat similar puzzle to what was here before, but a bit different. Or fucked up. Ah, <laughs> oh, so I have to be pressed in the right order. That was not the right one to start with, which is why it reset. So that's an arrow. Like, or not an arrow, sorry. They died by a blade. This one died by being drowned by goo. Ugh, horrifying. They were strangled. They were killed by arrows. I have just drowned. Oh, that's the one covered in goo. The arrow's bite doth sting. Wait, we have one drowned and one with the arrows. Uh, they hanged me long ago, yet I feel everything. So that's the rope one, but still the worst, not last nor first, the sharpened blade did ring. Yeah, just one with a sharpened blade, so it's not first or last. This is another, like, order of operations, elimination kind of thing. So, arrow... They hanged me long ago 
So maybe the first? They hanged me long ago. Yeah, probably the first is the rope. They hanged me long ago. Not first nor last. Which means it... Was it the arrow? Not first nor last, the sharpened blade. No, that means... Maybe it's the blade. Then the arrow, then the drowning? Nope, almost right. Yeah, so this one is definitely first, right? It doesn't reset, does it? Nope, that's definitely right. And I didn't actually pay attention to whether it resets. Is this one right? Yeah. Yeah, that one's right. So that means it's um, drowning and then arrows. Haha. <laughs> That would be the deep in the basement, I guess. Curious what's out here, though. I mean, aside from an enemy. Locked. Okay. Well, at least I got a crafting ingredient. Worth it for all those shots? Probably not. No, no, duh. That doesn't actually hurt you, it just hurts me. Is it because I'm sprinting towards it? Like, maybe it doesn't happen if I walk towards it. I want to see. Yeah, okay. If you just walk towards it, she doesn't jump down and break all her legs. The silver mask is in the small room in the back. I'm so close. Oh, Christ, it's right there. Let's try stealth, even though my flashlight's on. Oh my god. Ugh. I can't focus when I'm crouched. Pipe bomb, ooh. Oh no. Yeah, it recognized me. What is that? Oh, right, the note. Okay, surely it can't follow me in here. It would never fit. Never. Yeah. Yeah, we're safe. I don't think I'm killing that thing. I don't think there's any point in using the pipe bomb on it. 
like that's a big bad boss i there's no way this is where i meant to kill it you know Fuck off! Fuck off, fuck off. Bye bye. Now, did it just reset its position? Or is it like gone, gone? It just reset its position, okay. Well, at least I opened everything up. There's no way I'm going to sneak around it, so... Slow it down. Pick up any loot if I can. Oh, that didn't last long. And then go, go, go. So the stronger the opponent, the less long it lasts. Gotcha! Fuck. I was hoping I could just sneak right by it. Can I craft? Yes. Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh, you can use your ability as like a getaway. A getaway free thing. And I have another sprig. I don't think these can crawl, can they? No? Okay, I think I'm good. Oh. No, 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 no. Fuck off. No, that wasn't open before. Hmm. I got it, but just barely. This ugly brute turned up. No shit! I can't fight something like that. I'll take all the help I can get. Thank you. All right, I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Yeah, so far I love this. This is really cool. Hope you've enjoyed it as well and I'll be back soon.